If your site is slow to load, you're going to have frustrated customers and clients. How do you measure the time to load of your site? Sure, you could point your browser to the page and click a stopwatch, but to do that effectively, you'd have to first clear your browser's cache, otherwise you'll get inaccurate data. One way to get a more accurate reading of site load time is by using the curl command. Let me show you how it's done. Chances are your Linux distribution includes curl by default. If not, it's found in the standard repositories and can be installed with commands like sudo apt-get install curl-y, sudo dnf install curl-y. With curl installed, we can now run the command to test the load time of your site. The command contains the following elements. The command, a bit of formatted text to let us know what we're doing, and the URL we're acting on. Backslash n is a return. Backslash t is a tab. The options we will use. The output file. The URL or IP address to be used. The output of the command will display in an easy-to-read format. If your site uses HTTPS, you can issue a similar command. The only difference is you'll include the time underscore app connect and time underscore redirect options. You can make this command considerably easier to run by creating a curl formatting file and then issuing the command calling the file. Here's how. First, create a file with the command nano tilde slash curl dash formatting dot text. In that file include options for time underscore name lookup, time underscore connect, time underscore app connect, time underscore pre-transfer, time underscore redirect, time underscore start transfer, time underscore total. Save and close the file. Now run the command like so, where address is either the URL or IP address of the site to be tested. curl w double quote at curl dash format dot text double quote dash o slash dev slash null dash s address. The output should be the same as if you ran the command with all of the options in line. If you want to learn more in the ways of everything tech, be sure to subscribe to our Tech Republic YouTube channel and watch more how-to videos at How to Make Tech Work.